Here is how you use Control Center on iPhone. But first, hit the like and subscribe buttons down below. It really helps me out. Thank you. So from our home screen or lock screen, we just swipe down from the far right and this will open the Control Center. You can swipe up to change between each menu here. You tap on the empty space to exit Control Center or alternatively, you swipe up from the bottom like this. Inside the Control Center, on the first page, if we want to add or rearrange our icons, we either tap the plus button or we long press on the empty space to enter edit mode. Inside of edit mode, we can drag and drop any icon, including these icons here, to any part of our screen. We can select the add control to add a control. And so you can see all these options here and you just tap to add and you can drag and drop this around as you please. You tap the empty space to confirm your editing. Now these other menus here with the music, you can also long press these, uh, long press the empty space first, and we can actually remove these controls if you want. And so you can only have a one page control center if that's what you like on the old software. But if we long press on the empty space, swipe up, we can have as many pages as we would like. So in my case, I'll look for the now playing and I'll increase that size to full screen to add it back. And if you remove that connectivity area, just swipe that down to have it full screen. And so hopefully that one helps.